statistical policy analysis. Oh. Yes. I think he is a screwball. <laughs> mm, right. I don't know. All right. Uh, this one should get me in trouble. <laughs> mm-hmm. Yep. Oh, yeah. Yeah, I'm saying this one's roasting me. <laughs> All right. Uh, looking for a city. Yes. Okay, so follow at look for the number four, right? Yes. Uh, a, letter A, and then city. Yes. Yeah. <laughs> Right. <laughs> Look for a city, and uh, of course, the the actual uh, account name is looking for a city whose builder and maker is God. <laughs> right <laughs> now, there's there's no word on who God is. <laughs> right, right. No, there's not. I mean, it doesn't say it doesn't say Jesus. Yes, it doesn't say. Muhammad, yes. it doesn't say, I don't know, pick one. <laughs> it doesn't say which one. It just says uh, C-Cot. Uh, well, actually, it's a, it's a hashtag, the, the C-Cot thing. Yes. Yeah, I don't know. Yes. <laughs> uh, and then another hashtag, T-Cot. Yes. <laughs> and then uh, another hashtag, Oh, this might be God. Right. Uh, Yeshua. Right. Right? Is that a... Isn't that like Yahweh? Right. Am I confused? Is Yahweh not God? Yes. Right. I don't know. Uh, she's 1A and 2A, of course. Uh, she loves Israel. Yes. Likes long walks on the beach. Yeah. Right. She's also pro-life, so if you knock her up, you're screwed. Uh, right. She's pro-Israel. Uh, yes. She already said that. Yes. Uh, well, I guess if you say it with the heart emoji and the Israeli flag. Yes. And then you say it further down your profile with the hashtag and actually type out pro-Israel. Yes. I, I guess that's like double strong or something. <laughs> right. Uh, also, she says, don't blame me. I voted for DJT. Uh, poking a little fun at Biden there, I, I guess. But, uh... Fuck Joe Biden. Yes. Yeah. Right. Yeah, absolutely. Uh, MAGA, oh, of course. Yes. <laughs> right. Uh, U.S. Air Force Cold War veteran and patriot. I follow back patriots. No porn, no solicitation. Yes. Or I will fucking kill you. <laughs> right. <laughs> but I love God. <laughs> <laughs> right. Mm -hmm. I love God. Mm -hmm. So follow her up. She sounds like a ball of fun. Yes. <laughs> right. Uh, of course, I'm not following back, but... Uh, <laughs> right. You know. What the hell? You, you got the shout out on the show. Yes. Like, shut the fuck up. Yes. What do you want? Right. Uh, and I, I think I've mentioned this guy before. Yes. Uh, but I'm going to mention him again just to fucking annoy you. Yes. Um, <laughs> Tom Anon. Yes. Uh, Debelli. Yes. <laughs> No, it says right here, Bell. <laughs> right. Yeah. 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 Uh, Tom Anon, and then uh, two short letters, D E, right? Yes. Yeah. Right. <laughs> like, like that stupid French thing. <laughs> right. And, and then B A I L L E U L. Yes. <laughs> right. Bell. <laughs> Like Louis Vuitton. <laughs> right. <laughs> oh, and that's another thing that really burns my ass. Yes. <laughs> right. Yeah, a flame about this high. Yeah. <laughs> no, no, no. The, the, the thing that really burns my ass. Yes. The, the, there's this commercial. I don't know where it is. I think maybe it's on the... the 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 radio station here they yes. they keep Fox News stream on all day yes right 
and, and all I'm getting is like the only thing I don't pay attention to the fucking shit, but <laughs> right. when the, when the commercial segments come on, yes. right. You know, they, they've got these little jingle songs that, that are catchy. So you're like, yes. right. And it's for something stupid, like fucking house insurance or something. Right. Right. But I'm, 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 so I'm, I'm bopping along every time they go for a commercial break. I'm I'm bopping along these songs. Well, one of these songs, no, no, it's one of these commercials. Uh, one of these commercials, this one girl is rattling off names of designers, right? Yes. Like, like. Louis Vuitton. <laughs> right. Only she's saying Louis Vuitton. <laughs> now, now, don't get me wrong. I hate French people. Yes. <laughs> right. Can't fucking stand them. <laughs> Would set them on fire if I could right now. I, I just... Right. Like... You know, the, the, there's two things in this world I hate. Yes. One is Muslims. Yes. Uh, right. Because they actually did something to deserve that, right? Right. And the other is French people just for existing. <laughs> right? See, and that's the thing. And, and, and it just goes to show, like, yes. you know, I'm not racist at all. No. No. I just fucking hate french <laughs> right. right that's that's not it's not about race right no it, it isn't it's about fucking assholery <laughs> right good yeah anyway anyway uh, i'm getting sidetracked again yeah. uh anyway um yeah so so the girl she's like uh louis vuitton yes oh hermes yes <laughs> right I'm like you fucking troglodyte. <laughs> you remember Sergeant Hartman from Full Metal Jacket? <laughs> Arlie Ermy. <laughs> remember him? Right. Well, the next time you want to say Hermes. <laughs> right. Right? Lose the H. Yes. Lose the S. Yes. And say, Erme. <laughs> right. Does that sound good? Good. Yeah. It's it's not a lot to ask. Yes. <laughs> the, the French people, and, and again, I want to reiterate, I hate French people, right? <laughs> right. But, but, but they hear that Hermes shit, right? Right. And what you're doing is you're making yourself actually stupider than what I perceive as the stupidest people on the planet. <laughs> right. right. Yeah. You ever, you, 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 you want, oh, I can't even. Think. Yes. I can't even. <laughs> right. I, I was going to like give you an example and I'm just like, nah, fuck, it gives me chills. I, I don't. <laughs> right. I cannot do it, huh? <laughs> Fucking. Anyway, yes, Biff. Yes, Biff. Yes, Biff. Back to the shout outs. Back to the headlines. Back to the show. <laughs> right. All right. So, uh, Tom Anon D. Belly. <laughs> right. Uh, you can follow him at Tom Anon. Nice and simple. Yes. <laughs> right. He is a mega independent. Independent. Yes. Mega independent. What the fuck is that? <laughs> uh, he says he's tree hugging. Yes. Conservative. <laughs> right. Uh, senior rescue dogs are the best. Uh, 100%. We'll follow back. We'll see you soon, buddy. In the blink of a. Okay, scratch this guy. Forget it. <laughs> right. <laughs> God, he fucking left a lump in my throat. I, right. No, for, for, forget Tom and on. He's a nut job. Right. Fuck that. All right, let, let's get on to the, uh, the the stories that matter to you, of course. Uh, now, you can follow along, folks, at home if you're at your Twitter there. Just get on over to at Speculation News, all one word. Yes. Uh, no spaces or anything. No. No, just fucking type it out and go. <laughs> right. 
And uh, you, too, will get the benefit of going through these stories with us and enjoying the full-color photos. <laughs> right. <laughs> That's right, and it's provided to you all absolutely free. <laughs> There's absolutely no charge for the service. And sometimes, yes. sometimes they've done this before. Yes. Every once in a while, they'll pull out a story with video. <laughs> right. Yeah. yeah, you ever want to see a 54-year-old man get an erection fast? <laughs> yeah. Right. Right. I pull out that that video boy, and I'm just like, "Fung." <laughs> Good. Oh uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. All right. So yeah, the the story. Uh, well, first headline up tonight, of course, is national news. Yes. Uh, last night, Anderson Cooper was in the middle of an interview with uh, Bill Gates. An unexpected question about having sex with an eight-year-old boy on Epstein Island came up. <laughs> In the midst of the COVID interview, Gates' reaction was damning Reuters and the Associated Press report. <laughs> right. Yeah. Yeah, look at him there in that picture, huh? Yeah. Right. See, see, that's what I mean, folks. You won't get the full benefit of this unless you actually see this. Yes. <laughs> right. right. Like, luckily, here in the studio, uh, we've got a, a, a screen sharing program. Yes. So it, I put my screen up here on, on the wall thing. We've got a 50 inch on the wall there. And yes. That way, Gilbert and Bill and, and Hockabox can join uh, in, you know. Yeah. Right. <laughs> but, uh, yeah. Wow. He, he, he looks shocked. Yeah. Right. All righty, so he's having sex with kids, and that's okay. And that, that's the other thing. How is that okay? Yes. Like, <laughs> right. God, you know, I'm I'm 54. If 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 I look at a 20 year old the wrong way, the whole world's like filthy pedo. <laughs> right. <clears throat> I don't get it. Sex is only the tip of the iceberg. Oh, it's good to see you're still awake, sir. <laughs> right. Mm. All right. Are you still awake? You enjoying yourself? Yeah. They get f***ing crazy because all of a sudden, 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 nobody loves them. You okay, Louis? What the fuck was that, man? That was a mistake on my part. I would say so, yeah. Yes. Uh, yeah. But this is what I mean. Like, uh, okay, so so Anderson Cooper, holy shit, actually does some some journalism. Yes. Finally, he he's talking to Bill Gates. Well, first of all, I got I got a question. Yes. And why is anybody talking to Bill Gates about COVID and vaccines? <laughs> right. Right. <clears throat> like, why would you do that? This is a, a businessman. Yes. Who's into computer software? Yes. And for the last forty years, has plagued us with fucking Windows. <laughs> right. Right. Well, why are we all, like, all the media, like yes. CBS, NBC, MSNBC, ABC, LBC, <laughs> fucking, right. you know, CNN, <laughs> YNN, TNN, all the NNs. <laughs> right. Hey, everybody's got this guy on almost every night talking about COVID yes. and vaccines and viruses. Yes. and uh, he, he He's a nerd businessman who's shitty at his job, who reads a lot of books. What, what are you doing? Right. I don't know. I don't know. I don't get it. Doesn't make any sense. Uh, anyway, news out of Washington tonight. Yes. Uh, yes, ladies and gentlemen, he has done it. With only hours left in 2021, Joe Biden says that tri international depression is finally a reality. Wow. Yeah. That's right. Try international depression is a reality. The plan, although extremely vague, yes, well, is supposed to cost another six hundred billion dollars. But really, who fucking cares anymore? <laughs> right. <laughs> and will provide many things. Yes, including Tiberiatic man fishers. <laughs> right. <laughs> And stop port spurring on the pressure. Right. 
Well, what do you think about that, kids? <laughs>